Tokyo is one of the largest cities in the world and one of the most popular destinations for foodies like me. With over 160,000 restaurants, there is plenty to choose from for hungry diners. I am lucky enough to visit Tokyo a few times a year and stay for a couple of weeks at a time. The Japanese take food very seriously and I can honestly say that I've never had a bad meal. While there are loads of different types of Japanese cuisine, I have a few favorites which I eat every time I visit this amazing mega city. So I would like to show you five of my favorite Japanese dishes that I eat every time I visit Tokyo. Sushi is probably the most famous Japanese food and for very good reason. It is uniquely Japanese, it is healthy and it is delicious. There are loads of sushi restaurants in Tokyo, ranging from inexpensive to the outrageously expensive, with some sushi restaurants charging over $300 per person for a sushi meal. It's not hard to find a reasonably priced sushi restaurant in Tokyo. There are also some really cool restaurants like Genki Sushi, that are a real novelty with the sushi being delivered on a conveyor belt. I think the best kind of sushi restaurants to visit are the ones with the sushi chef standing right in front of you, preparing your meal fresh and delivering it straight to you once it's ready. This is the full dining experience. You get to eat some delicious sushi with some entertainment watching the expert skills of the sushi chefs. Most chefs complete an apprenticeship in two years. To become a sushi chef, it takes more than five years, training under the head sushi chef. It can take up to 20 years to become the head chef of a sushi restaurant. Japanese ramen noodle soup may be one of the most popular Japanese dishes in Tokyo, with over 10,000 ramen restaurants to choose from. I think a ramen noodle soup is a big bowl of yummy, a great meal for lunch or dinner, and a lot of ramen restaurants are open until very early into the morning, like 3 or 4 a.m. The perfect meal after leaving the pub with a belly full of beer. There are four main types of the ramen broth that is used as a soup. There is a pork based soup, miso based, soy sauce based and a salt based soup. There are plenty of other varieties including a chicken broth or a vegetarian broth soup. Ramen is a quick and cheap meal. In Tokyo you can get a bowl of ramen soup ranging from a cheap ramen at around 500 yen up to a more expensive bowl of ramen of over a thousand yen. Yakiniku is your classic Japanese barbecue. Yakiniku literally means grilled meat in Japanese. Now most Yakiniku restaurants in Tokyo have a small coal or gas barbecue located right on the dining table. On the menu is a selection of meat, seafood and vegetables, which you cook up yourself on the small barbecue. Now I think this is all about the meat and meat is good. This is the perfect meal to sit back and relax 
have a few cold beers while you grill up your favourite cuts of meat. Most restaurants have a range of prices for the meats, with a variety ranging from cheap cuts of meat, even offal dishes like intestines and stomach linings. There are also the expensive cuts of meat, like high grade Wagyu or Kobe beef, which will put a dent in your wallet. Katsu in Japanese means cutlet. This is usually a pork cutlet or a chicken cutlet which is breaded and deep fried. And as we all know, anything deep fried is delicious. While a Japanese katsu is traditionally served with some sliced cabbage, a bowl of rice and delicious katsu sauce, my favourite way to eat katsu is with some spicy Japanese curry. This is real comfort food. Another great dish to drink beer with, or a meal after a big session at the pub. There are loads of Japanese curry restaurants in Tokyo. The most popular include Koko Curry, Gogo Curry, and Curry House CNC, which all serve up delicious katsu curry at a very reasonable price. Last but not least is my favourite Japanese snack food, takoyaki. While this dish originated in Osaka, it is a very popular street food found all over Tokyo. This is a little piece of octopus coated in a batter and grilled in these very special takoyaki grills. I just love watching the chefs grill these bad boys up. What I love more is eating them. Little bits of delicious takoyaki which are crispy on the outside, gooey in the middle, with a chewy piece of octopus right in the centre. Now I'm hungry after making this video. I need to get back to Tokyo real soon for my fix of my favourite Japanese foods. I really hope you've enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Thanks for watching and happy eating everyone.